Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In addition to interrupting tasks, you can also reschedule entire tasks in a project by moving them to a new date. If using auto-scheduled tasks that are linked together, Project asks if you want to move the related tasks as well when you move the initial task within the linked tasks. When you are moving tasks, always inspect the tasks after you move them to ensure you haven't broken any task dependencies or violated any task constraints, like a start on date constraint for a related task. To move a task, select the task in the Gantt chart view of the project file. Then click the Move drop-down button in the Tasks button group on the Task tab in the ribbon. Then select the Direction and Duration to move the task from the choices shown in the drop-down menu that appears. If you select the custom choice, then enter the number of days to move the task either forwards or backwards into the dialog box that appears, and then click the OK button to finish moving the task. You may also see another dialog box that asks if you want to reschedule any tasks that are related to the task you have moved. You can select your desired response in this dialog box and then click the OK button to confirm your choice. To reschedule tasks to the next time resources become available, select the When Resources Are Available choice from the drop-down menu. To move parts of a finished task back to a status date, or incomplete parts of a task forward to the next status date. Choose either the completed parts to status date or incomplete parts to status date commands in the drop down menu. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.